Everything's Coming Up Roses for Robert Sammons and John Martin. Together they own and operate a commercial rose garden and business called Westmont Park Roses at Hawthorne Road and Road 20 Northwest in Soap Lake. In recent years, Sammons and Martin redeveloped a once disheveled home site into an elegant, naturally walled off two acre garden. Today it's a showpiece with the fragrant scent of 1,400 rose bushes wafting through the air. And there's still room to grow. The garden just started here and you know, it just keeps evolving. While Salmons is the rose expert, Martin says he's more the student who is learning the business of growing and selling roses. Salmons said Westmont Park Roses is becoming an attraction in Soap Lake. What it's evolved into is, you know, people wanting to know what's back there, <laughs> what's there, you know, and it's sort of screaming to be shared a bit. So we've been having garden tours on Thursdays, you know, we've... Uh, shared more time with friends, doing meals, dinners, relatives, celebrating our lives here with friends and family. Seeing the potential of the gardens becoming a special events venue, Salmons and Martin have started a project to create a space for staging weddings and the like. But roses are the thing at Westmont, where Salmons and Martin put together bouquets that will be delivered to events and individuals. We sell to uh, Florists in Seattle primarily because they have a market, event planners in Seattle, private individuals also. This is going to a business. We just dug 110 roses out of the garden for a sale in Seattle, a woman who wanted garden in place, wedding coming up in July. Why grow roses? Roses uh, are the longest lasting floral probably. They kind of are very good in this area naturally. Uh, the romanticism that goes with a rose. If you go into garden clubs throughout America, nothing is prized more than the garden rose. You know what I mean? It's just the absolute uh, epitome of uh, high-powered floral arrangements. Uh, you know, what, what is in demand and the more cultivated atmospheres in our country. Salmon said his family and relatives grew gardens in the Midwest, and that is where he became attached to roses as a young man. Salmon said he learned young in life that gardening is good for the soul. You know, you felt what atmosphere can do to the spirit. So at a young age, you try to implement that in your environment. And starting to create a garden is just part of bettering life. To set up a Westmont Park garden tour, call John Martin at 509-398-7673. I'm Jeff Chu for iFiber One News.